In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you how you can make the right choices when choosing the niche that your agency goes into. This is for everybody who's starting out their very own AI agency and want to work out which companies to target, which niches to go after. Um, there are so many of them and it can be so overwhelming that it kind of is a blocker for people getting started. It is a question we get asked on a daily basis in our Discord. It is a question I get asked on our weekly calls that we do as well. So yeah, this video is gonna be focused on helping you choose the right niche for your business. Before I start with today's video, I just wanna do a quick introduction into who I am for those that don't know. I'm Connor Walsh, the founder of the AI Mentors, a company which is set up to help businesses with AI automation and implementation. We have consultancy calls with clients, we do project work with them to help them choose the best fit automation tools and AI tools for their business. I've been in business now for around eight years, specifically on this business for around 12 months, and we're growing massively, and that's why we've now gone into the realms of helping people start up their very own AI agencies, because the market is massive. Now, before we dive into the topic of niche selection, it's very important that you make sure that starting your own AI agency is right for you. I've already released a video which explains exactly what an AI automation agency does. Please, please, please go and watch that first if you haven't already. Based on my experience working within the AI space, starting an AI agency is one of the best business models that you can do if you have an interest and a passion for AI. It's a really good balance between keeping in the knowledge, understanding exactly what's going on in the AI world, being able to implement it and do those research calls with your clients allows you to stay on top of your game. This is gonna be so important in the future. AI is taking over, I'm sure you've seen it everywhere. Businesses are using it uh, more and more so. In the next five, 10 years, it is just gonna go like that, I promise you. So if you can get into an AI agency space now and start working with clients, you're gonna be staying on top of things. It's not like reading blogs, it's not like watching YouTube videos. You're gonna be in the real life world learning and using good AI products that are coming forward the best and understanding what's new, what's fresh and what works. So now, now's the time to be in with an AI agency. I also forgot to add, this business model allows you to work from anywhere in the world, which is my personal favorite thing. You can do consultancy, sat on a beach in Dubai. You can set up a call in Hong Kong. You can set up a meeting from a golf course in Portugal. That's my favorite thing, work from anywhere. To support all of those people who are interested in starting up their own agency, we have a program um, which I'll put a message in the description of this video where you'll be able to come straight through to me if you're interested in joining it. The program essentially teaches you from start to finish how to launch and scale your very own AI agency. We give you all the tips, tricks, and, and tools that we use and all the experience that I have in weekly coaching calls with me um, in groups no more than eight people. So if you're interested in finding out how to get involved in that, the message will be here in the description. You'll be able to come straight through to my WhatsApp and let's have a conversation there. Um, hope to see you there very soon. Cheers. We also help you choose the right offers to send out and making sure we have the right deliverables for you to, to set yourself so that you're hitting certain numbers. As I mentioned before, the aim is to get you to three calls per day for a minimum of 500 pounds per call. That is our ultimate aim. That's 1,500 pounds a day. That is 7,500 pounds a week. That's the aim. And that is the plan to get you there. So hopefully you're interested in joining the program. If you are, hit me up right here. See you there. Step one is to simplify and specialize. Instead of taking a bunch of different services to market, you find one deliverable that works for your clients and you take that to market. That becomes your one deliverable. To become an expert in this particular field, you really need to understand your product. You need to understand who you're targeting and what problem it solves for them. Step two is to identify a high impact deliverable. We need to find a product that is cost effective for you, high impact for your clients in terms of profitability and resource saving. Get that product. For example, let's say you find a chatbot which you take to market to electricians that help them not miss out on overnight calls, you know, emergency calls, all my lights have gone out and we find that problem and we get our product and we take that to market with them. Once you have that product, we stick to that one thing and that is what we're gonna home in on and that is gonna be our draw for winning our clients initially. Step three is to go away and do some research and analyze what your competitors are doing. It's important to understand um, based on the industry that you want to go into and based on the niche that you want to target, what problems are they currently having? Go and do some research, work out what your competitors are also offering. You know, go and connect with some other AI um, agencies and find out what, 
what their angle is. Once you understand that, you can go to market with a better solution, a cheaper solution, or just target more people more effectively, which is something that we will help you do as part of our program as well. Go and do that. Do your research and analyze what other people are doing. Step four is to test and validate. Work out your deliverable, work out the product that you're taking to market and go and test that with a small group of clients or even use a better tester as well. Refine your offering and based on the feedback received, you can make amendments, you make changes, but do that. Make sure you're testing the product that you're taking to market and how it's taken to market as well. Step five is build a gradual process. Start with your one deliverable, your one product that you take to market. And once you have success with that and you understand and you have a good impact within the area and your niche, you can then start to add on other services, other deliverables that you can also then take to market. You can then expand your offering and grow your business that way. Step six is to start using the Trojan horse method. What that essentially means is have one small product that you can get into a client with, i.e. let's imagine you use this chatbot, right? Low priced, low cost for them. You say, look, we're doing an offer on a chatbot. Do you, would you consider using a chatbot? You implement that chatbot with them. You gain that reputation. You gain that relationship with them. And then once the relationship is formed, you can then start to upsell, put other products in there. Start talking about other ways that AI can have a good impact into their business. The Trojan horse method works every single time. Number seven is to be clear and specific about what your product will do for them and the problems it will solve. It's very important to use real life situations, real life examples of where your product has helped other companies make money and save money. So do that. By niching down and understanding what your clients expect within your niche, you can then start to add on more and more services to your initial product offering. So let's say you go to your client and you put in there a chatbot with them. If you're in a specific niche and you then start to understand what other problems you can solve, you can then start to upsell, sell those other solutions and therefore make more money every time you do that. This also means that you can differentiate yourself within the market and start to pitch yourself as an expert within the AI field of their niche. So guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you found it useful. Uh, remember, it all starts with finding the right niche to go into, having the right product to go to market with, and that is something that the AI Mentors is able to help you with. If you're interested in getting involved and starting your own AI agency, drop me a message. There'll be a button right here in the, in, in the description. Click it, come and have a conversation with me completely free. Let's talk about how you can start your own AI agency and offer the top level AI services to your chosen niche. Thanks guys. Please like and subscribe there or there. Somewhere there. Thanks guys. Bye.